Hey everybody, it's Teresa with High Mesa Standards and we are here on day number two and we are setting up for the Kiowa High Plains Kennel Club show. And so I just kind of wanted to uh, show you around a little bit and show you what I do for all those that ask what I do on the days that I'm going to show or that I'm not um, at my kennel. So over here, which I've never done, um, this is the rally area, rally ring. This is where they do obedience and rally and you know, all that kind of thing. I plan to start that soon. People are trying to talk me into it and give me confidence in that. <laughs> Which it's obedience, you'd think that would be my thing, but I'm afraid of those cones and stuff. I don't know, anyways. And this is also another rally ring or um, obedience trial ring. <clears throat> and then, excuse me, on this side, we have all of the show rings, so confirmation rings. These are only confirmation rings. And so depending on what group you're in, like um, if you are a uh, showing, you know, hounds or if you're showing sight or, um, gosh, I can't think if you're showing gun dogs or if you're showing guard dogs or whatever, they'll be dependent on which ring you're in or dependent on which group. <laughs> it's early. What group you're showing will depend on what ring you're in. So they have all the ribbons set up and all the, um, the tables for showing little bitty dogs. That's what that's for right there. And um, because it's really hard for the judges to bend way down and see the, the whole dog. So um yeah so they'll show on each little uh, stand here they will show whether bait is allowed meaning you can use a food to show your dog or a treat or toy or whatever um and then it will also have a roster here that tells who's in this ring and what um what uh time they will go in and how many of each breed and what varieties they will have. That'll be on there. They're working on that already or this morning. So then over on that side over there, they have the hospitality tent for the judges uh, right there. And then they have the table for sign-ins and all that stuff. So that's what I do here on the show days. And um, I really do enjoy it very much. Um, not as much as training my puppies, but I do enjoy show. So, um, and show helps me to know that I'm breeding the correct dogs. Um, it's, it's confirmation to me, not just conformation of the dog, but confirmation to me that I am going in the right direction. I have friends that are in the poodle world. They're all in that area over there that also kind of, you know, you can bounce things off of and say, um, what do you think about this dog or how I'm moving this dog or um, is this dog something that you would breed or, you know, that kind of thing. Um, it's nice to have the camaraderie of other poodle people that know poodles better than you, better than I do. Um, and so that's what I really enjoy that part of uh, showing is just being able to kind of see other dogs and compare what I'm breeding to what other people are breeding and really um, that's the only chance I get to do that look at this little baby right here she's so adorable oh my goodness she's only six months old anyways I love all of them and they all have attributes that are amazing and then they all have their faults too so you know we're just trying to do the best that we can by breeding the best quality that we can in our in our poodle world so uh, hope this gives you a little more information of why I do the shows and if you have any questions you can put them in the question box down below and hope you have a great day blessings